Eesh, this is a rough one. Uh, there's only two things I could think of that are worse than your own dog uh, taking a crap into your mouth. Um, number two is it being so bad you have to go to the hospital for it. Like, dang, this ain't just a bad day. Like my chihuahua craps in my mouth and I'm like, I can't believe you did that. I take care of you. I'm, I'm not telling nobody about this. <laughs> it's usually just that. But you have to go to the hospital? Like, that's pretty bad. But the only thing worse than both of those, uh, imagine your dog takes a crap in your mouth. You have to go to the hospital for it. And then you wake up and it's in the headlines. Jesus, that's a... That's a that's a that's a threefer. <laughs> that has layers. You just like why is it in headlines? This whole all these people in this hospital, we all here for different reasons. Why am I in headlines? This is a dude with an axe. He came in with an axe in his face. <laughs> There's people with gerbils and Hot Wheels up their butt. There's all types of people. Interesting stories here. Why you gotta center in on me and my dog's problems? That dog is being put down. <laughs> I'm, I'm, <laughs> if, if, if your dog craps in your mouth, you get hospitalized, have to pay the, the bills, you have to pay the medical bills, and it may, makes headlines, it makes the paper, it makes the shade room, then you got to go home and feed it. Oh, shot. <laughs> I'm taking old Yeller into the back of the barn. Just kidding, PETA, don't flag this post. I don't know what this person did to this little poor chihuahua, but it got, and they say every dog has its day. This dog got the ultimate revenge for something. And uh, I'm on the dog side. I feel like dogs know, they know it's up on a spiritual level. I'm on the dog side. But if, But if this happened to me, Come on, come to the back old yeller. <laughs> come to the woods, I gotta show you something. Cause, nah. Oh, oh, nah. Then you gotta go home and clean its poop? Nah.